Hopefully this is enough. Be nice. Ah. Okay, so I kind of wanted to do a clip of me coming into the room like those cool vloggers do but apparently when I came here there were a lot of issues with the key and now my door can't open from the outside and it can't lock either also so yeah, but it's okay I am settled in Everything seems to be working, but I think right now what I need to do is do an inventory review and check whether I have all the stuff. Okay, so bed frame, set mattress, built-in bookshelf, be this plastic chair, ceiling fan, open wardrobe, there we go. Full height mirror. Hello. Small whiteboard. Aircon with remote, definitely working. Alright, nice. Let's go. Okay, so that's done. I guess what we do now is clean up a bit. Huh? Okay, nice, done. Oof, that's dusty. Also, they just came by and I think they calibrated my key into my NUS card, so I think it, my door should be working. Yep. Okay, so I guess the door working in the room, clean. I guess you can start to unpack. Something is not right. I think my bed sheets are okay. Here's Steph Curry pulling up from free. Boom. As you can see, my shampoo has leaked. Bad. Okay, so right now I'm unpacked, so I guess I can go out and start showing all the room. Right, so here it is. Okay. So, right as we walk in, we see a full length mirror. Hello, very nice. With an air conditioning unit. This open cupboard area we have a single size bed then we have this table that looks pretty good looks new i think only one owner has stayed here in the past some bookshelves and two sets of windows one at the table and one in the corner of the room a set of shots underneath the table and beside the bed so let's look at the view shall we so it's not great um my room's on the side which is facing like the buildings but on the other side it's like facing greenery but it's not bad, you can still kind of see the sky from here but let's see that for the room like it's not very big but I think it's already much better than many of the other hall rooms in NUS because of how new it is it like only got renovated recently and it's air conditioning unit alright, time to go check out the rest of the place Here's the toilet situation. Got some sinks. Three shower stalls. And some regular toilet stalls. Pretty scenic track over here. Nice fountain. Coming up, we have a pretty good view of all the buildings in the sunlight. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Sheesh. Over here, we have some vending machines. 
This one predominantly sells potato chips and canned coffee. I guess it's the bane of every uni student's diet. This is supposed to be some late night restaurant. Here we are entering the PGP Plaza. Food court. Yeah, I think I'll have my dinner here. Okay. So I got some Indian food for dinner. Happy. It's okay for 560 I guess, but the chicken is a bit cold. The naan is pretty solid though. All done. Time to go to the mini mart. Finally back. I did uh, quite a bit of walking around just now and the whole PGPH estate as a whole looks pretty good, right? You get some pretty scenic views of many of the buildings and you really get that sense of tranquility uh, because it's a pretty quiet environment for a university hall. So I think that's one big plus for people who like that kind of feeling in their halls or maybe introverts who prefer something more quiet. Yeah. There are many facilities and amenities available for like various pastimes. Huh? So there were two full-size basketball courts, a tennis court, and I think that while the gymnasium and the multi-purpose hall court is currently closed, there are still people who are like playing badminton in the open. So the facilities right now are not bad, pretty good. Um, for dinner, even though the food court was supposed to close at 8 p.m. right, so I went there at 1 7, but a lot of the stores were already shutting down right and. Uh, at first I went to the noodle store to grab some noodles but ended up they had run out of stock so I had to opt for Indian cuisine instead. Yeah, so that bear that in mind now. And then I went to the mini mart and the interesting thing is that um, for a lot of the supermarkets, uh, the mini supermarkets or the canteen stores right here in the university, a lot of the payment methods are cashless. So I paid just now using pay now. Lah. So if you're intending to come to the state, just ensure that you have Methods other than cash are like pay now, pay la, credit, debit. Now that I'm back, I think I'll just chill, enjoy what I've bought, uh, maybe watch a few shows and wine. There's also a pantry here, which I think is pretty well stocked with like cooking materials. We have an oven, a microwave, a fridge. So, every room gets their own basket, right? Where you can put your food. So stuff in I just spent like the past hour just staring at my phone screen. There's not really a lot to do here at night and it gets pretty quiet. Yeah. But well I guess it's kinda late, it's 9 30 already. I guess I'll go take a shower then. Okay, so just got back from the shower and I guess the pros are that one, the shower cubicle is big, so you have ample room to hang all your stuff. And the water does get hot, which is a bonus after six months of NS. But the cons are like, the shower pressure isn't as much as I would have liked, it's kind of weak. And the temperature of the water fluctuates a lot, so I almost got scalded like once or twice. Lah. So yeah, it is what it is, I guess. But still hot water though, I'm not going to complain about that. Anyway, I guess the plans for the rest of the night. I think I'll just watch some YouTube, uh, some Netflix before I sleep. Huh? It's gonna be a pretty early bedtime. I'm watching ReZero right now. It's pretty good. Alright, 
just came back from brushing my teeth. Oh, so, it's the end of uh, the first day settling into PGPH. And it's been a pretty good experience so far. Uh. Right from the get-go, I managed to encounter a lot of friendly people, like ushers, like technicians who helped to guide me around, help me fix my issues even when my door was being locked out and when I was being lost, for instance. So as a whole, after my first day at PGPH, how do I feel? I think it's really solid hall. It's very clean, very comfortable, especially because it was renovated so recently. So 10 out of 10 will recommend to any prospective uni student wanting to get a good hall experience. Anyway, it's late. It's about 11.50 now. Should let me go into bed now. So yeah, adios. See you when I see ya. Sister